Hey everybody, this is Hunting Is All I Do, and today I just received in the mail my Joker Sprain Assisted Knife. Um, this is pretty similar to the um, Cuba 3.0 that I've seen on YouTube multiple times, except this is much better quality, in my opinion. No, I have not personally owned the um, Cupid 3.0, but from what everyone's saying, they're saying, you know, these handle grip is made out of plastic, and it's just a piece of crap. Um, but I, then again, I can't necessarily say it is because I don't own it. But what I do know from OTF knives is that every time you eject them, they're always loose. The blade's always loose. Like, for instance, this one. Okay, I know this is really cheap. I bought this, like, like for four bucks at a thrift shop. Um, and, I mean, sure, oh, wow, that's so cool. Well, look at how bulky that dumb thing is. I mean, it just it looks dumb, for one. And look, I mean, this blade, sorry, I'm filming with one hand and doing, uh, holding the knife the other, but, um, look at, look at how, uh, wiggly that blade is. I mean, it's just a piece of crap, in my opinion. So, yeah, it's, you know, whoa, so cool. Not, but, um, I just personally, OTF knives are only good if you really buy the really expensive ones. So I kind of shied away from that, and I decided to go with the Spring Assist knives, a knife. Um, I never, oh, this is my very first one. Um, I fooled around with a friends of mine, but uh, this is really technically my first one. And uh, I, let me tell you, I really like it. Um, I'm going to show you how it springs open here. Very fast. Uh, excellent blade, no m wiggling or anything. Um, solid. These plates are aluminum. You take a, a magnet to them and put it on here, it sticks. Uh, very nice knife. Eight inches total uh, when it's ejected, the knife blade. About four inches with the blade in. Uh, the blade itself a little over three and a half inches. Um, half of the blade, sorry, this camera won't focus, but half of the blade is serrated, the other half is not, and this half, the non-serrated part, is very sharp, very sharp. Um, there's a little, the little locking mechanism is here. Um, excellent knife. I already can tell you this is going to be, I already know, almost know this is better than the Cupid 3.0. I'm um, not trying to be boastful or anything, but hey, this is 12 bucks and for 12, well, $12 and 45 cents, but who counts 45 cents nowadays? Um, so I bought this basically for 12 bucks off of eBay, brand new, from a guy named Knives Deal. Um, I highly recommend him. Very fast shipping. Um, sorry about that. Uh, shipped from New Jersey here to Michigan. Got here in about three days. Actually, I ordered it Thursday night, got here today, which is Monday. Um, excellent knife. All metal. Belt clip is very nice, very sturdy, very firm. Um, the blade is, I, you won't be able to see it, but it says 1040 surgical steel, handcrafted in ROC. I have no idea what that means, um, but anyway. And that says limited edition. And also it says Joker right there, which some people might not like. Um, just because they like to have a knife that's completely different. But to me, I do like it. And none of my friends have this, so to me it's different. Um, I'll let you just see. I'll let you just kind of look at it. Kind of similar to the Cupid, except this is smaller. Quite a bit smaller. More portable. <laughs> and it's legal. To carry, <laughs> which I would carry an OT knife, OTF knife anyway, but still, don't want to get caught. Very fast, really nice knife, highly recommended, especially since it's 12 bucks. So, um, all right, guys, this is uh, hunting is all I do. I will be having more hunting videos for you. Well, ah, this is not a hunting video, but I will. Hunts, the hunts, the November hunt is coming up, and I will hopefully get some hunting videos of me actually hunting deer. Um, okay, guys, um, talk to you later.